foodies, I am Rosewood Villitas, your chef mom. Join me for another round of 10-Minute Kitchen Wonders here on Quick Fire, your step-by-step -step guide to everyday delicious meals for the busy you. And for today, we have our guest, Ms. Maggie Wilson and Anna Teresa Licaros. Hi. Hi, how are you? We're great. great. Thanks for having us. Of course. What can I do for you girls? Well, Maggie and I really love Japanese food. Right. And in particular, we're so crazy about sushi. Because mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. very mm -hmm. healthy. Pa. Yes. We want to eat it, but it's like intimidating. Yes, it's like 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 Relax and I'll be back in less than 10 minutes. Alright. So, gusto ng ating mga guests ng sushi recipe, pero nahihirapan sila or they think na parang it's complicated. So, I have here a very easy recipe. Quick, fast, makakagawa na kayo agad ng sushi. So, I have here my rice which I bought from takeout. Para naman mas madali tayong makasave ng time. Let's get a bowl for this. Let's dump it all here. Let's mix our sugar with our apple cider vinegar. Instead of using marine or rice wine vinegar, I'm just gonna use apple cider. Yeah, tapos let's just mix it to slowly dissolve the sugar sa ating vinegar. Ito ang ilalagay ko sa ating rice. Itong rice na to, hindi na ako gumamit ng Japanese rice. Ito, ordinary rice lang, yung mga rice na, na ginagamit nyo sa inyong mga bahay, pwede na siyang gamitin. Ang gagawin natin dito, I will slowly mix our apple cider vinegar and sugar dito sa ating rice. Okay. Mix lang natin siya. Kasi kailangan medyo magdikit-dikit or maging compact ang ating rice. Pwede na to. Let's just set this aside. Ngayon, itong sushi na to or this maki, the reason why I call it Manila maki, kasi diba, we're used to using mga raw fish. Pero instead of using raw fish, gagamit ako ngayon ng tilapia. Pero I'll cook it, I will fry it. Hindi ko siya isa-serve ng raw. So let's just heat our pan. Let's put a little bit of oil. konti lang to coat our pan. Yan. We have your our tilapia fillets. Pwede na kayong bumilit na sa inyong fishmonger. Request nyo sa kanila yan. Na naka-fillet na. And let's season it with some salt and pepper. Here. And to make it more tasty, of course, let's not forget ang ating pampasarap, ang ating Ajinomoto Umami Super Seasoning. Alam nyo ba na ang stock made from konbu or kelp or what we call seaweed has long been used in Japanese cooking? And then, they found out na ang source pala ng pagiging malinamnam niya ay yung glutamate content. Kaya naman na-drive nila doon, or that's when they found out na ito ay ang umami flavor. Kaya nagkaroon sila ng umami taste, which means delicious. At nalagay na natin ating fish to fry. Now, I will get our green mangoes. Ito, green mangoes, very staple to sa Pinoy cooking o kaya sa Pinoy cuisine. I have it here. Nakapeel na siya. Let's just use our peeler para ma... Yan. Thinly slice natin ang ating green mangoes. Habang nagpo-fry ang ating fish. Ito, itong green mangoes, syempre, halos lahat ng kilala kong babae mahilig dito. So, since very fine na ang ating, ano, we can just slice it thinly. Let's check our fish now. Yan, brown na yung ating fish. Let's lower the heat. Okay, yung ganaw, ready na tayo mag-assemble ng ating maki. Let's get our nori sheets and our... Foil. Kasi usually yung ginagamit naman talaga for making the maki, rolling the maki, is a bamboo mat. Pero kung wala kayong bamboo mat sa bahay nyo, you could use this one instead. So ayan, meron tayo ditong foil paper. Punin natin ang ating nori sheet. Ito nabibilang to sa mga Japanese stores. Meron na rin to sa inyong mga grocery stores. And just get one. And the secret in mixing your maki, ang dapat importante dyan, your hands are also wet so that hindi siya magkikling sa inyong kamay. Like, when you handle the rice, hindi siya didikit sa inyong kamay if you have wet hands. Let's check our fish first. This is cooked already. Okay na siya. Let's turn this off. I will now assemble the sushi rice. So, let's just wet our hands. I'll wet my hands. Kuha lang tayo ng rice. Let's place it on top of the nori sheet. Thin layer lang ng rice. Let's press it. Press it down. Let's get our fish. Okay lang kung halimbawa madurog-durog yung yung fish kasi mamaya naman if flake rin natin siya. So we can assemble it to our maki. Baka nagtatakayo, ano bang ibig sabihin ng maki? Ang ibig sabihin lang na maki is rolled. 
So anything na ruled in Japanese food, that's maki. So lalagay natin to sa, yan, sa halos dulo ng ating sushi rice. So kung gusto yung ibang klaseng fish naman, or you want to stick to traditional Japanese makis or sushi, pwede rin yun. Ito naman variation lang siya para ma-inject natin ng Pinoy flavor sa ating maki. Yan, meron tayo ditong green mangoes. Now, i-roll na natin siya. The secret is what you have to do, make sure na nasa-secure nyo yung inyong nori sheet with every roll. Last roll. Just secure it. So, here's our roll. We're just gonna slice this one. Pag mag-slice naman kayo nito, what you need is a wet knife para hindi siya kumapit sa ating nori sheet. Let's get our knife. Pasain natin. Let's just slice it. So, pababa. Favorite ko pa naman ng tilapia. Tapos gusto ko rin ng sushi rice. Kahit nga itong nori sheet, gusto ko itong ninangatay. I like eating it. Para lang siyang junk food for me. Pinafry ko and then I eat it. Ayan, ready na ang ating Manila Maki. I can now put it on top of the platter. Pero hindi pa yan tapos kasi may bonus pa ako para sa ating mga guests. So meron na tayo ditong non-traditional Japanese cuisine. Gagawa naman ako ng traditional. We have here our crab sticks. Yan, nabibili nyo na rin sa inyong mga groceries. Readily available everywhere. Pwede tayong apat. Tanggalin na yun. Meron tayo ditong paper. Let's just take it out. And slice this into half. Okay, we have here our sushi rice and our seaweed. Let's just cut this using our scissors. Pwede rin kayo gumamit ng inyong knife. But to make your lives easier, let's just use this. So, andito ang ating sushi rice. Basahin ulit natin ating kamay. And grab small portion. Let's put it on top of our chopping board. Lagyan natin ng crab stick. And let's wrap it with our nori sheet. So, yung iba nilalagay nila instead of crab stick, pwede rin na mga prawn roll, May prawns na parang steam lang. And of course, let's not forget our dipping sauce. We have here soy sauce, Japanese soy sauce. And our wasabi. Meron wasabi powder na you can buy. Tapos you're just gonna mix water. Yun, mas intense ang flavor. Pero para hindi kayo masyado mahirapan, meron na rin wasabi paste na available. Okay, here's our dipping sauce. And we have here our Manila Maki done in less than 10 minutes. Ayan na girl, so in less than 10 minutes, and wow. na yung sushi platter. Okay, ang ating so lagi akin to. <laughs> Guess time dalawa. Sorry, Sorry ka naman hindi siya mahilig sa wasabi sa yung sayo. Oh, akin na yung uh, wasabi. Are you tip it first? Ahead and try. Oh, game na. Oh, sige. Ang laki, walang points. Wait, wait. How was it? Sige, kamayin mo na kayo. Parang <laughs> punong puno ng kanin na ganyan. <laughs> Gusto ko yung green mang. You like it? Mm -hmm. Is it sour? I didn't try this one. Hindi siya sour, pero hindi rin siya kasing sweet ng yung fresh mang. Uh -huh. Parang hindi mango. mango. Yes. So, hindi niya nilalabanan yung lasa nung, ano, uh -huh. tilapia. nung tilapia. You know what? I really, really like the originality. Kasi syempre, it's, you know, Manila Maki, yeah. tapos may tilapia siya, may green mango, and you don't really have green mangoes in, you know, in sushi. And it's really, really good. Yung contrast, like what they're saying, mm -hmm. it's really, really good. Nainggit ako, ba't nagaling? Parang compact. <laughs> Kasi nung gumawa ako, parang nakatayo siya nung umpisa. Uh -huh. Nung sinerbo na siya, makaganan na kaganan na sila <laughs> lahat. Nag-death na siya. Oo, oh, bakit? Paano mo ginawa? Alam mo, practice lang yan. Just make 10 rolls in a day. Tapos mm -hmm. following day, makakagawa ka ng mga 20. Ganun yan. Mabilis ka nang gumawa. So, mataba na kami ba yan? <laughs> so, I hope naman ay natulungan ka sa kayo yes. sa inyo. Yes. Very much. Problema. Thank you. Sana naman hindi na kayo matakot at ma-intimidate to try out mm -hmm. making mga sushi. Yes, kaya namin. <laughs> thank you so much for joining me. Thank you. And of course, I'd like to thank Vika Cookware, Royal Dalton, Princess Appliances, Elbow Cookers, Savers Appliance Depot, and Sari of Benefit Style Salon. Whether raw or cooked, Japanese food is made even more delicious gamit ang umami ng Ajinomoto. Join me again next time here on Quick Fire, your 10-minute kitchen wonders.